How's it going ladies and bruises? I'm Bobby Sixkiller and welcome back to Yakuza Kiwami. I just got out of that fight from the last episode and Majima's here. Like he seems to be bloody everywhere now. Like literally before I could never find him. We got through the whole game without ever finding him but now he's bloody everywhere. Yo Kiri-chan. Majima-san. <laughs> I don't know what the big rush is but I don't plan on letting you pass without so much as a word. And I don't plan on changing the path I'm walking. As long as you're standing in the way I'll face you as many times as it takes. Come on. Oh, Kitty is starting to get into this. Gotcha. <laughs> get up, you pansy. You have no idea what you're up against right now. We're still way beyond your scale. Although he'll rank up after this one, so we might actually end up facing off against a legit scary ass Majima. He's actually putting up a decent fight, considering. Though in the long run, it's not going to matter. You're going to pay for that. Boom. Oh, hello. Someone's actually got some fight in him. Do we have something that gives us a little bit of heat? No? It doesn't matter, we don't need it. We just power through him. We're too strong. Maybe we will have to fight Majima a few times before we wrap this episode up. You're pretty damn tough. That's what I'd expect from the one and only Kitty you chan You look pretty relaxed for having lost. Damn straight. I have so much fun fighting you. I can't help but feel good about you. About it. The more we fight, the more pumped up I get. I can fight you forever. You sure about that? But it looks like I lose this time. We can pick up where we left off later. See you around. Can't avoid fighting Mart with Majima son. I need to be prepared at all times. I'm always prepared. Learn Heat of the Dragon. Did I not already have that? D-Rag. No? Are you serious? Ah. We need to do a thing to go D-Rag. Alright. Guess what we're doing this episode. We're doing Majima hunting again. Kiri-san. I have a message from the boss. He says, it's a riddle for you. I seriously don't understand him. Let's roll together. Alright. I'll bring you back once I figure out what the hell that means. Oh, we got a phone call. What's happening? Hello? Kitty son? This is Nishida from the Majima family. You. What's the problem now? No problem at all. In fact, you were released from prison recently, right? Did anyone celebrate your release? I was expelled from the family. Why would there be any kind of celebration? That's depressing, isn't it? The boss has graciously, graciously decided to entertain you, sir. Do you know a club called Asia just down Pink Street? Asia? The bikini bar? That's where you want to celebrate my release? Exactly. The boss reserved the entire place for this private party. So you don't have to worry about anything. He'll be close to the public. Sounds like Margin, my son. Alright. Well, I'm sure he's got some kind of ulterior motive for this. Yeah, he's gonna fight. I understand that you can be a very intense... He can be a very... You can be a very intense man, sir. But please, this is just a present from the boss. If you have time, please swing by. Fine, I'll get my options open. Thank you, he'll be waiting for you. <laughs> He's gonna fight me, I know that. He's probably gonna attack me. If I go over there, I better make sure I'm ready for anything. Dude, I'm always ready for anything. Oh, there's a green ma marker on the thing. Oh, sir. I've heard a lot about you from the Majima family. Cool. Is this the way in? Is Majima dancing? Oh, of course he is. I knew that was gonna happen. This is the thumbnail. <laughs> now that's a thumbnail. <laughs> Majima, you're so crazy it's starting to get predictable. <laughs> Welcome, Kitty-chan. So, did I get you pumped up? Huh? Yeah, right. 
If I'd known you were just gonna fool around like you always do, I wouldn't have come. Aw? So you thought you get to see some hot ladies? Oh, Kitty-chan, is that really what's on your mind? Yeah. Th that's not it. But can you honestly call a dance like that appropriate for someone's welcome back party? What? Are you dissatisfied with the entertainment? I'll tell you what, tonight you can vouch- you can touch the dancers all you want. I wouldn't touch you with a ten-foot pole. I'm out of here. Wait. Are you saying you can't accept my welcome back party and the entertainment I provided? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Even if it means I'll lose face over it? That'd be ridiculous. I never should have had a welcome back party in the first place. I declined the sentiment with all due respect. <laughs> then you prepared to face the consequences? So be it. I'll make sure you pay me back tenfold for all the expense I've gone through for you. Let's do this. It's showtime. <sighs> I'm gonna destroy you. Oh no, he's in he's an Eddie style. But that's okay, there's chairs everywhere. We're gonna go beast mode for this. Oh no you don't. Nearly got out of that. See ya! <laughs> gonna be like that, is it? It's time to go down! <laughs> <laughs> now we go to D-Rank. Fool. <laughs> cool. So, how was it? Super steamy, right? Uh. Yeah. That was the kind of dance I'd never get to enjoy while I was behind bars. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Dancers need an audience to really get them going. Well, there's just nothing spicy about it. Majima san, I know this is a little late, but I'm grateful that you thought to welcome me back. Despite your methods. Screw that. I didn't wait for you to get out or pull off a stunt like this for your damn gratitude. I just wanted a serious fight. Besides, ten years ago on a murder charge ain't shit. It's a walk in the park, especially compared to him. Mm -hmm. Oh, forget it. Show's over anyway. See you around, kitty chan As usual, he shows you a glimpse of someone serious and then goes right back to his usual self. Essence of Mad Dog, Whirl. Nice! Alright, well, I guess it's time to go back on the Majima hunt, I, I... I suppose. I'm sure we can do this. I'm sure we can find more Majima out there. In the wild. Wild Majimas. I'll see what I can find, and then I'll bring you back if I come across anything. Oh, we found a card. That's nice. One day it'll be enough to actually do the next thing. Maybe I have to get to 45 first. Which seems like it'll take for literally ever. But whatever. Found him. Where is he? He's in a trash can. What the hell? I knew I heard your voice, you bastard. You gonna hang out in trash cans? You lunatic. Look. This is how it's gonna go down. Because, because you're hiding in a trash can, I'm gonna beat you up. With a trash can. You broke my trash can! Dude, I was gonna kill you with that trash can. That's not okay. Gotcha. Alright, let's end him. Oh! Oh, oh that was brutal. Oh god! Again! <laughs> I know he's kind of a psychopath, but that's unnecessary! End him! <laughs> Sorry, Majima. <laughs> this is fun! I'm having a great time hunting Majimas. Stand so damn- oh yeah, I remember that. 
That gives us another rank, yeah? Oh, not another rank. Some points towards a rank. Jeez, that means we have to do it like five times. Alright, Bin Majima. Alright, alright. I'll bring you back if I find something else. But for now, I don't know where to look. My Majima senses are tingling. Majima! Yo, Kitty Chan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the, I know the, I know the use. Let's tussle, fool. Watch out for those coin lockers. That's where I keep all my bullshit. Look what I found. <laughs> Slap you in the back of the head with a cone. Oh. Maybe I was going to beat you up with a bin last time? I brought the bin back. How <laughs> are you going to get out of a grab when I'm grabbing you from behind? That's going to make it difficult. <laughs> Man, he's taking a pounding out there. <laughs> You have no idea what you're up against, Majima. End him. <laughs> this is going great. All right, give me my points. Alright, I'm gonna go back to hunting him. I'll bring you back once I'm done hunting him again. I was actually gonna deposit some crap into the save dealie. Alright, we'll just buy some stuff here and then... Would you like it warmed up? Okay, we were just uh, shopping again for healing items and stuff. He must mean the bento. Yeah, sure. Is that so? Then let's take it outside. Huh? Martin, my son. I was getting so bored and cold. What a fight. With you, would warm me right up, Kitty Chan. If you're cold, put some clothes on for once. You don't need to fight me to warm up. Hey, but you said you wanted it warm. So give me some of that heat action already. What? That's not what I meant when I said yes to the question. Oh, so now you're a man who backs down from his word, huh? Doesn't sound like a man at all to me. This is a ridiculous fight. I'll warm you up, but if you end up burnt, then sit and warn you. That's clever. I'm shaking in my boots, Kitty Chan. Hope you're ready too. You should be shaking your boots. The amount of times I've handed your ass to you now. Like, seriously. I beat you all up and down this place. I'll beat your ass up and down this place. Like you're nothing. You're definitely getting stronger. But at the moment, you're still nothing to us. Okay, that's it. Don't grab me, asshole! I do the grabbing around here. <laughs> He's not even giving much XP, to be honest. Considering he is Majima. He's usually dropping like... 5 XP or something. Oh, I'm ready! <laughs> Are you? Phew, that damage! That damage! We got enough points to spend on like one upgrade. Oh! Moving on. <laughs> you give up? Nothing beats a nice warm kitty you chant in the winter. I swear he's coming on to me. I swear he's got the hearts for me. You got my temperature so hot I feel like I'm gonna overheat. You got me so hot. Yep, I'm running real hot now. How am I supposed to cool down? I gotta release this heat somehow if I want to fight. Take a piss. He's gonna make sure- yeah, he's gonna keep my guard up all the time. <laughs> Nearly up to, <laughs> to C rank. Alright, I'll bring you back once I find him again. Any Majimas in here? Hey, you! Mm -hmm. You talking to me? Oh. Yeah, 
Got some time you could spare me? Oh, a side mission, cool. Not exactly, but... What do you need? Just looking for someone to lend me in here. Come on over, sit, have a drink. Okay. Uh. What have I got to lose? <laughs> Alright. Creep me out, dude. But at least I can beat you up if I need to. So you want something? <laughs> sure do. I've been asking everyone who comes through this place. Got a small favour to ask. Is this some kind of scam? I'm not interested. Just hear me out. You don't happen to have 2,000 yen bill, do you? Mm. A 2,000 yen bill? No, I don't. Is there even such a thing? Eh? Seriously? We're already at the point where people don't know they exist. Sorry, I'm not exactly up to speed on current events. We've been in jail for 10 years. Are you living abroad or something? Something like that. Well then, I guess you can get a pass. The 2,000 yen bill is a new bill issued in the year 2000. The Treasury issued it to commemorate the Okinawa Summit. It even got a little more buzz because the two on the bill resembled the American $20 bill. Five years ago, huh? Yeah, that would explain why I don't know about it. But a 2000 yen bill, just because it's the year 2000, sounds a little lame. Anyway, what about it? I'm a collector, you see. My collection is currently from various countries. So naturally I wanted to add the 2000 yen bill to my collection, but there's a problem. The government didn't actually actually issue it as a commemorative bill. If it was going into wide circulation, I figured I could get it any time, so I wasn't exactly making an effort. Yeah, I guess at that point it'd be no different than collecting a 1,000 or 5,000 yen bill. Uh... Exactly. But the problem is, this 2,000 yen bill is disappearing from circulation at an alarming rate. Mm. That's weird. Money just changes hands from one guy to the next. Why would the bills start disappearing? Because a collector's collecting them? I don't know what's going on, but the bill has practically become phantom currency. As a collector, I can't stand for this. Uh... So I've decided to collect them on my own, but I'm having a real tough, rough go of it. So I was hoping I could recruit some help. I see. I get what you're saying, but I, I don't know that I can really help you that much. Sure, perhaps you're right. But if there was someone helping me, it would sure go faster. And I would, of course, compensate you for your trouble. For every 2,000 yen bill you bring me, I'll pay you 20,000 yen. It's a pretty good deal, isn't it? So 2,000 yen becomes 20,000. I can't argue with that. But is it really worth that to you? <laughs> Just because the numbers on the bill tell you what it's worth, that doesn't mean that it can't be worth more. Besides, each and every bill has a history of its own. There's something interesting about a bill that simply didn't catch on and stopped being circulated. You can follow its history. So that's how you see it. Indeed it is. So, if you find a 2000 yen bill somewhere, can you bring it to me? My collection is going to need five of them uh. specifically. Five, huh? If I find one, I'll bring it to you. <laughs> Thanks a lot. I'll probably introduce myself. My name is Takanashi. What's yours? Kiryu. Kiryu Chana. Alright. Consider it memorized. Thanks for searching for those 2000 yen bills. No problem. Well, I mean, if we find one, we, we do. A lot of money does go through our hands, so, you know, there's a chance. Hi. No thanks. Just checking with you to see if there's anything here. Anything happening? You, you're nobody? No. Well, 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 if it ain't my good pal Kitty chan Are you serious? You are everywhere, literally. Don't tell me you're gonna try and fight me here of all places. Yeah. Bullseye. Well, that's what I want to do anyway, but not today. It's the day to play darts, Kitty chan Really? Well, at least that's different. I guess I can go around. Kitty chan do I detect some actual enthusiasm? I hope you know they call me Goro Tun 80. Majima in these parts. <laughs> you better bring the best darts game you got, bud. Shit, I'm no good at darts. Not in real life or in a freaking in the game I, I don't even know what the rules mean <laughs> so that's a problem in this game the value of the sections you hit is deducted from your score the goal is to reach zero going below zero is called bust it becomes your opponent's turn if you bust yeah. the player brings their score to exactly zero before the set number of rounds at the end is a winner whoever has the fewest points wins Oh god. I don't like it. Select darts. Aim. Throw power. Oh, we are boned. We are boned. I want to fight instead. I'm good at fighting. <laughs> Shit. So what's our score? We got 301. We want to make that as, as small as possible. Shit. Oh, come on! Hit that 20, yo! What do we get? What are we down to?
We're down to 275. Are you serious? You're going to throw the same things as me? Well, there's no way any of us are going to get to zero before the time's out. Damn it! What the hell was that? Was that a triple 20? Dude. Lucky. Alright, we're catching up. I mean, catching up. We're, we're getting, uh... Getting ahead. Come on, come on. Oh, yes. 95, we don't want to go bust, though. We're getting real close to going bust here. So, most we can do in one dart is 60, though, so... Triple 18, double 20 is what we want. Apparently. What was that? Jesus Christ, I didn't even hit the board half the time. <laughs> Final round. A bullseye. Are you serious? I missed the book. Oh, we are gonna lose. We are gonna lose. You'd have to really screw up now. You actually got it to zero? There is no way. Doesn't count if you actually hit, don't actually hit the board. Well, Kitty Chan, you're no Majima, but you're pretty damn good. Come play me again sometime. Okay, there's a side mission on the uh, on the board as well, so maybe we need to do that as well. Maybe it's something to do with the 2,000 yen bill. I don't know. We'll check it out. We'll check it out. Is it this place? Look, I don't want to fight you pricks, okay? You're in my way. You are nothing but a pathetic obstacle. You aren't even worth my time, idiot. Oh my god, that scooter just went flying. Who's next? Come here. Piece of shit. Now, I was doing something when you interrupted me, you ass. Is there something here I'm looking for? You. This money is weird. I don't want weird money. You can have it. Are you sure? I'm in the best spirit. Sing the sweat it. <laughs> don't spend it all in one place now. Okay, that was easy. He just gave me a, a 2,000 yen bill. Cool. Alright, now as I was saying, we're going to go to the pawn shop. See if we can find some better darts that will actually fly straight. Oh crap, I just heard the Majima. Where are you? In the car? You guys leave me alone. Dude, I, I don't want to be- Arrgh! You're gonna interrupt my fight with Majima! You assholes! I am sick of you bastards! Jumping in when you're not wanted, huh? How many of you do I have to beat up before you get the message? Hmm? God's sakes, you guys are just a glutton for punishment, man. Idiot. You're done. I'm finished with you. 
that damage. Now. See, he's gone now. That's what happens. Son of a bitch. I see him. He's over there. Go, go, go. Get out of my way. Let's fight. <laughs> I'm going to destroy you. What is that thing on the ground? I'm going to kill you with it. Oh god, it's fireworks. Oh, that is... That is ruthless. Dude. He put fireworks in his mouth and then make him fall over with them in his mouth. That's not very nice at all. Kid you, I thought you were a nicer guy than that. Actually, I think if you're doing it to Majima, it's okay. He'd do a lot worse to us if he could. He nearly got out of it. This has been a long episode of fighting Majimas. Days and days and days of fighting Majimas. Good night. <laughs> the Majima hunt is real. You look pretty relaxed. Oh, yeah, yeah, the same, same as this last time. Give me some points towards the next rank. Oh, we're getting so close. So close to C rank. Alright, where's that pawn shop? It's over here somewhere. Alright, let's go. Get out of my way! And you. I don't care how tough you think you are. <laughs> I don't care how tough you think you are, you're actually a big fucking pansy. Hey dude, I need darts. Battle test 10 million! Dude, I can't do that. Cards! Yes! And parts for the... Parts for the car! Oh, there's so much good stuff here. Wooden katana, I need that as well! I forgot about the wooden katana, but I can't get the darts, I can't afford them. They're 10 million yen, for Christ's sake. I want these as well. And, and this, and this. We can sell some stuff though. Maybe that'll get us some more uh, Mesu King. We can play more Mesu King now, maybe. Let's see if we can sell some crap. Are you playing Jingle Bells in the background? I love it. Scotch Whiskey, I don't need that. Pocket Tissues, I don't need that. It would sell well, but you might incur Divine Wrath. Yeah, I don't want that. I'm not down for Divine Wrath right now. At least we got a lot of crap to sell. That's pretty neat. You can take the Bun Chan as well, I don't want that either. All the rest is just random crap. Oh wait. That stuff's just crap as well. There you go, we made a million bucks. There's still not enough of those darts though. But! Now we can go do the training! With the wooden katana! God damn, we're out of time for this episode, but it looks like we've got another episode of side missions ahead of us. We have a wooden katana, we still need to find some more darts somewhere, I gotta figure out where we're gonna get those. And we're gonna keep hunting Majimas, and yeah. We've got at least one more episode of side missions before we move on to the main story mission. Till then, I hope you guys enjoyed it, thanks for watching, thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll see you in the next one!